Hey kids, welcome to H&M Storytime. I'm Mr. Eli. Miss Samantha will be here shortly. She decided to have me do the story today. Little does she know she's gonna help me with the story. I didn't tell her yet. So today we're gonna learn about how the angel shows up to the shepherds to tell them that Jesus is born. Are you excited about this story? Because I'm super excited about this story. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna find Miss Samantha and she's gonna read the story and then we'll talk about it in a few minutes. Are you ready? Let's go find Miss Samantha. Miss Samantha. Miss Samantha. Miss Samantha, there you are. Hi. Did you have a good little break? Yeah, I was trying to find my hot cocoa. Oh, it's that's okay. important. It is, I'll have some after. Oh, before we get started, did you see my jingles? I found my jingle bells, my earrings, my necklace, and my bracelet. So hopefully you can hear me tell the story. So last time we learned about who? Mary. Mary and the angel, who was scary apparently, told her, do not be afraid. So today, the angels are gonna talk to who? The shepherds. What are shepherds? The shepherds are the ones that get paid to watch the sheep. Oh, okay. Let's read about that story. So angels tell the good news of Jesus's birth to shepherds found in Luke chapter two, verses eight to 20. So you see the shepherd and then you see an angel. He looks pretty surprised. So let's find out what happens. On the night Jesus was born, some shepherds were out in the fields near the city of Bethlehem, taking care of their sheep. What do sheep say? Bah. It was dark and quiet. So everyone cover your eyes, close your mouth. Suddenly the shepherd saw an angel. Everyone open their eyes. The shepherds were terrified. The angel said, Do not be afraid. I have good news for you and for everyone else. The Savior has been born in Bethlehem. You will find the baby wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. As soon as the angel finished talking, the sky was full of angels. They were all praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest and peace on earth. Suddenly, the angels were gone. The shepherds looked at each other. They said, let's go to Bethlehem and see this baby. So they ran to Bethlehem and found baby Jesus lying in a manger, just as the angels had said. The shepherds were so happy that they told everyone they saw about Jesus. They praised God for sending his son, Jesus. Wow, so the angels always had good news to tell. They told Mary that she was gonna be the mom of God's son. They had good news to tell the shepherds that Jesus was here. The Messiah, God's son, was here to save the world. Miss Samantha, have you ever seen a bunch of angels sing in the sky before? I've never even seen one angel, but apparently I would be scared. So maybe, I don't know. They would have to tell me to not be afraid. But what would you do? Probably just stare. I don't know. What would you do? No, I don't know. You know, some people in the Bible fell down. They were so scared to see that little angel or big angel, I don't know. They fell on the floor and the angel had to say, do not be afraid, get up, I gotta tell you something. So I don't know, would be scary. All right, so last week we learned our verse about the angel telling Mary good news. And this week we have our verse of the angel telling the shepherds the good news. This one is in Luke chapter two, verses 10 and 11. The angel said, I bring you good news of great joy. A savior has been born. He is Christ the Lord. So this has a lot of good parts. Let's practice together. Ready, ready, ready? Okay. Yeah. Luke 2 verses 10 and 11. Luke 2 verses 10 and 11. The angel said. The angel said. I bring you good news. I bring you good news. Of great joy. Of great joy. A savior has been born. A savior has been born. He is Christ the Lord. He is Christ the Lord. All right, let's try that one more time. I need to hear your best Christmas voices and let's Let me go. hear you out in the hallway. You know I'm there. <laughs> Luke 2 verses 10 and 11. Luke 2 verses 10 and 11. The angel said. The angel said. I bring you good news of great joy. I bring you good news of great joy. A savior has been born. A savior has been born. He is Christ the Lord. He is Christ the Lord. 
That was so good. I think we should do it one more time so loud that our parents can hear us in the sanctuary. Do you think we can do that? My jingle earrings. Okay, let's try. Ready, set, go. Luke 2, verses 10 and 11. Luke 2, verses 10 and 11. The angel said, The angel said, I bring you good news of great joy. I bring you good news of great joy. A Savior has been born. He is Christ the Lord. A Savior has been born. He is Christ the Lord. So now we have two verses to treasure in our hearts to remind us about Christmas being all about Jesus. So come next week, it is Christmas Sunday. We're going to learn what happens next in this exciting story. Thanks for coming to H&M Storytime. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye.